Yeah, get fired up. Little dude. Caesars, did you dude. order the pizza? Yeah, I got a slight <laughs> Hitler going. Please look up swastika pizza. <laughs> Please Google that, dude. No. Yes, look at oh, that. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> that is a bad news pizza. <laughs> Little Caesars fires two workers. <laughs> and you know how it went. Oh, I've talked about it. You know how it went. They, one dude was like, I can't wait for him to pull this out of the oven and see that I ruined it. Oh. And the other guy just must have pulled it out, not even fucking looked at it, just thrown it in a box, <laughs> yeah. shipped it. Then the other guy's sitting there like, yo, what'd you do with that pizza? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, dude, it's out. It's all. It's tracking. Oh, these are the victims. They received his wife, Misty. <laughs> so my husband stopped at Little Caesars name dropping for a quick bite. Husband brings this home. I'm truly disappointed. Yeah, we're deeply disappointed by the actions. <laughs> uh, truthfully, yeah. and look, never put a swastika on a pizza. Right. Not advocating that. Yeah. They deserved to be fired. Yes. That's a good cancel. Yep. There's a good cancel there. Yeah, because it's dicey. You're using product to push your own agenda. <laughs> but those dudes are probably funny. Yeah. yeah it's no it's fucking funny, yes. I agree it's a fireball so some offense. People, right. And this is the owner of Little Caesars? Holy shit, dude. He's got a Roman haircut. <laughs> yeah, that is <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Caesars. 